And welcome to the Confound Millennial, starring Steven, Stervin, Michaels, and Ryan Diamonds. It's me. And that's What's you. Up, man? No. You know. I don't I know why. You. I don't know how this is set up on your computer. But uh-huh. Like every time you're like, and you, and you point like away from me. This isn't you? No, I'm the other way. On my screen, that's you. That's not you. That's me. Okay, I'll start doing that then. Anyway, who is I, this? I uh, heard we have a special guest today. Janie B. Oh, it's Janie B. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hey, Janie. What's happening? Oh, living life. Ah, here living you go. like Larry. <laughs> mm. Duh. So, Janie, uh, you have been on Invalid Input once or twice before. That is our... If you're unaware of it, um, I haven't really done well promoting Invalid Input on the main show, but this is what you're watching now. (laughs) What we three are on is the Confound Millennial. Now, that is a podcast. Of course, we do video for YouTube, but it's on like nine different audio sites. Now, Invalid Input, now that is a whenever we feel like it on a Friday – We'll do a live show. And, Power uh, granted. That's Facebook video exclusive. You can't find it on Spotify. You can't find it on YouTube. It's our Facebook. And we do our best to avoid getting Zuckerberg, but it's coming soon. So watch while you can. It's live. So you can join. We're going to hope not. <laughs> yeah, we do that to where uh, we do it to where you guys can join in on the show. Talk to us. Uh, make inappropriate comments at Diamonds, whatever, you know, we would usually do on our show. Sometimes he falls out of chairs. I've d- that's probably why this is broken. I just discovered <laughs> this is broken. That makes sense now. That's happened, I think, a couple times. Uh, I'll but the world out there knows me. <laughs> knows Diamonds. Janie is our social media manager through, what is the name of your social media company again? <laughs> Bacon social media management. Makes me hungry. <laughs> and want to get on Facebook at the same time. Is that what the B stands for? Or is that just a marketing ploy because everybody loves bacon? No, that's my last name. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Are you related to Kevin by any chance? Um, actually, my husband loves to tell everyone that's his cousin. <laughs> hey, probably to six degrees he knows him. I mean, that's valid. He did live in California, and I think that's where Kevin, you know, you know. I know a Sherry Bacon, too. She claims to know Kevin Bacon also. (laughs) I think that's just (laughs) like a trait. Yeah, yeah. I used to do pest control for a Marshall Tucker. And, uh, you know, that was a a bunch of, a group of guys that created the Marshall Tucker band. But he would sign Marshall Tucker albums and give them out during Christmas. (laughs) That's that's really funny. (laughs) That's great. Anyway, but <laughs> carrying on a little rabbit hole. You know, I what like this. I like this. I haven't had to talk for a second. Diamonds is on a roll. Where's this? <laughs> I don't know. I've just been uh, awestruck lately. Someone we talked to me. Tommy Chong, and you're just. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to say a word, <laughs> so I just let it roll. I did fall asleep a few times. Uh, no disrespect. I was on vacation. It was a very funny. comfortable chair. <laughs> My dad was like, why didn't you say anything? I was like, I was, I didn't have a chance. <laughs> I, didn't a wanna, <laughs> I didn't want to interrupt anybody. Oh, Dude, well, you had to interrupt him. That was the only way anyone got any words <laughs> in. And that whole show was interrupting each other. <laughs> yeah. Are people sometimes are just like that. Yeah. That's a fact. <laughs> <laughs> but uh we do have a couple episodes coming up i'm not going to say who but we're talking to some bands and it hopefully we can get to everybody before tour season starts we get but, a long uh, tour we got we got one band that's coming on hopefully it will be next week's episode that they're currently on tour there Our we go tour. And so that uh, shouldn't dude, stop them. They're coming to Kentucky. Nice. You gonna go see them? 
Yeah, it's rare a band I listen to actually comes through Kentucky. <laughs> the guys oh. in Enox are uh, coming up to Cincinnati soon, and I'm going to try to catch Cincinnati. them. I drove mm. through there last week. Really? I don't think I've been. I did. Did you go through Kentucky? Yeah. Um, so my parents live in Michigan, went to visit them. Um, it takes me through LJ. And then up that way to Tennessee. And then, yeah, cut through. I go straight through Lexington every single time. And then into Cincinnati. And then from Ohio into Michigan. Yeah, I guess it's, isn't Cincinnati kind of like straight up from Lexington? Yeah, yeah, like the bridge okay. from like, I'm like Kentucky way goes out straight to the into east Cincinnati. Of the state, <laughs> but still Cincinnati's close enough to where. You know, usually when bands go to Ohio, which is like pretty close to me, uh, but they always go like to the exact opposite end. Mm -hmm. But either way. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, I had some uh, friends in Grenada and they talked about um, the Grenada in their West Indies. And they always talked about visiting the United States. Like, oh, I want to see New York and California and this and this. And it's like, we're not this big. This this is a, a it's big a very country. large. <laughs> it's a lot of driving. I guess on a map it looks this big. So the thing they can see it all in a day. It's tough. I'm sure you could if you had a private jet. I mean, I maybe you, could. you wouldn't oh. see it all for sure. Hell, there's plenty of stuff I have seen around my town. Private jet, two days, <laughs> I can see all of America. <laughs> I mean, flying I'll hold you over it, it, probably. Yeah. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> <laughs> so, Janie, uh, <sighs> tell us a little bit about yourself since we know, or I know you, Diamonds doesn't know you, I guess. Uh, I tell Diamonds who you are. Not that right? I remember. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> um, so my name is Janie. Oh, um, okay. Hi, Janie. My last name is Bacon. Hi, my, Janie Bacon. Yes, right. <laughs> my husband and I have actually been married two years next Saturday. Congratulations. Um, we have three dogs, but one's a jerk and lives with my grandma. So, <laughs> you know. <laughs> He's yeah, I got a, three dogs. One of them's estranged. <laughs> yeah, we just get him on the weekends sometimes. It's just, you know, shared custody. Um, no, he he's a Chawini and my grandma is his person. So we just we just let her keep him. You allow that to happen. We do. That's but true. we got yeah, two dogs. I'd like to have 15 dogs, but you <laughs> I'll know send you one. where we live. Yeah. <laughs> I've got a buddy trying to get rid of a big old pit. She's a beautiful pit. Oh, we we have a big bubba and a medium bubba. Medium bubbas to small bubbas are probably good for me. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, let's see. I, my parents live in Michigan. I have a sister in Michigan and a sister in Indiana. I've got a couple siblings in Florida. Um, I my regular job. Um, is for a cabin rental company. So I do a lot of social media stuff for them, which Ooh. in turn just branched out to social media management for my parents' coffee company. Check out the Hippie Grind Coffee Company. Um, I work with a couple of other folks doing stuff and then the podcast. So are you around Ella J and stuff? No, I'm actually in Gainesville. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Because we usually so. go once a year and I was like, well. Oh. <laughs> well, if you want to rent in Helen, I got you. Oh, I'll bring it up. <laughs> I'm not in charge here. Yeah, <laughs> you yeah. Just they give her my number. Rent. I'll take care of it. <laughs> you should rent a cabin uh, around Easter time. Go up to Cleveland, Georgia. Oh, oh I do like That's the Cabbage true. Patch kids. Yeah. and oh uh, <laughs> I know something else you might like. That'll be in Cleveland, Georgia around that time. Uh, Sturvin with my belt. Yeah. With That's your a belt weird. And your hot yeah. sauce. And... <laughs> that sounds a uh, no kink shaming. 
<laughs> don't even let you touch my we bald head. We don't do that here. <laughs> Wax it. Uh, we're going you know, to Disney World for my birthday in two weeks. Ooh, nice. Never been. Been to Universal. My wife, my wife and daughter are excited, but I like being home. But I'll do it for them for my birthday. <laughs> but it's for them. It's for my birthday, Janie B. <laughs> happy, sorry happy sorry. birthday diamonds nerve. yeah man <laughs> 26 oh, yeah. you believe that Tw- yes 100 percent you don't look look how young my <laughs> <laughs> no, i'll be 40 whatever just another day but it's not about me it's about Janie b she says she doesn't oh. like cabbage patch kids i don't like i don't like dolls when i was like <laughs> Eight or nine, someone gave me like a porcelain doll that looked like me, but I made it live in my mom's room because we don't do dolls. <laughs> if it's going to haunt someone, it's going to haunt her. There you go. We should get uh, lookalike dolls, like all three of us, and get a good picture for... It can just live at your house. No, no. Each one of us gets all three. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, they can come and live at your house. <laughs> okay. I'll have six then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There you go. Oh, I think I think Sturvin's got something. What's he got going on over there? He has a doll of. I've got a duck. A Sturvin doll. That's cute. Oh, duck. <laughs> Unsolicited duck pics. <laughs> <laughs> the only kind of good unsolicited pics. <laughs> and who's this one? I don't know. He's got some chest hair. I'm gonna. It's a Mr. Brian Diamonds. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I don't have that much chest hair. <laughs> Look, man, <laughs> I, me I, I was it. trying and I was like, diamonds doesn't have any distinct features. <laughs> He's just like, here. I love you diamonds, <laughs> but you just look like a dude. I am. I am. a dude. I mean, you're just some uh, dude. You nailed it. I mean, you're like a great dude, but like <laughs> physically, you're just a dude. <sighs> Emotionally, mentally, spiritually, maybe <laughs> metaphysically, <laughs> you're much more. But how do I put that? How do I embody diamonds in a duck? It's not I mean, big enough. That's very hard. It's not a big enough <laughs> duck for me. <laughs> oh, so what kind of nerdy stuff? Dude, I can be Jamie? pulling ducks out all day. Like, what do you want from me? A gold duck. Mm-hmm. It's very cool. Um, nerdy stuff. Play, uh, play some magic. No. D and D. Yes. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, D and D. I'm playing the Hogwarts Legacy game. Um, Ooh. I have a Switch, but I haven't played it in a while. But I do play the Pokemon ones, like Pokemon Snap, because that was my favorite game that on is the fun. Nintendo 64. I do like that. Mm-hmm. Um, I watch a lot of like Marvel movies. Ooh, Chris I do I like do those. Yeah, see, mm-hmm. I have Mort. More, I'm Morris. Oh, <laughs> I got him from. I love that. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, but I had to. Be, he stays on my desk because my dogs think he's a toy and he's not. Of course. Did you like uh, the new Ant Man? Quantum. Um, Ant-Man? we haven't seen it yet. We saw. I'm listen. I don't go to the theater because I don't like people i don't like people in i like people i don't like people in you do so uh, we just wait till it's free on disney plus <laughs> can, we, oh, I see. can we go back for a second yes. people in people is that in. like a verb yes it can be wait yeah, yeah I like, we just i'd like people i don't like people in. yeah i'm a daddy I be but when my... people, <laughs> i just want to be in my house and certain people can come over but that's about invited. all i want <laughs> Like I could be a dad, but when my daughter's around, I'm baby daddy in. I don't like people. In. <laughs> I can't even. I can't even stand my cat half the time. That's sad. Did you realize Ant Man is in the word quantum mania? <laughs> I'm gonna spell it out. I just heard that. I've been. I've been I was like, I don't know, because that's a lot of letters. <laughs> Hold on, Quantumania. Yeah, yep. There Ant you go. Man. Yep, it's in there. <laughs> Ant you man. Uh, 
Because mm. you the man, Paul Rudd. That's right. He is. He I is do love young. some Paul Rudd. <laughs> yeah. huh. Have you ever seen when he's on uh, like talk shows and he's like, I got a clip of the new movie I'm working on. And they're like, no, you don't. And he's like, I do, I do. And he shows it and it's that, I can't remember what that movie is, but it's always the same clip from this old, like early 90s movie of an alien and a boy in a wheelchair and he falls off a cliff. <laughs> oh my no, God. I have to find I've it and send that. it to you. <laughs> every really time funny. he does it to conan every time he's That's on the hilarious. show hilarious no but i do like paul rudd yeah uh, he had a pretty neat show a while back too on netflix where he was like two people like clones but i don't know if they're gonna pick that back up he just came Nothing. out with a new song that was really catchy him what's and that? um oh what's his name he's a nighttime show host uh, jimmy fallon uh, Yes, and it's I called figure. Teeny Weenie Beanies. I have. You seen should this. look it up. It's <laughs> lovely. I enjoyed it so much that I FaceTimed my friend off my iPad with it on my phone, so she could also enjoy. Force it. her to watch it. Yeah, well, she loved it. So, was it really forcing? If she at, loved first, it. at first, I mean that's then true. It's consensual. <laughs> <laughs> Manny, I gotta apologize uh, for something. I didn't send you a video. I sent Diamonds last night, but Diamonds, please tell me you watched that. I song. did and shared it with everybody. What was it again? Is yeah. a the chicken, chicken attack? Chicken attack. I sent it to a friend of mine that loves yodeling, and he fell in love with it. Oh boy! So, so what it is, Janie, and everyone else out on the internet is there's like these four songs by this Japanese yodel guy who doesn't take it serious, but is like a professionally trained yodeler. And there's this, like he did a series with, uh, you remember the guys that used to do like songify stuff? Like they would, uh, ain't nobody got time for that. Mm -hmm. Yes. Sugar Brown, it's the guys Georgia that Brown. did that were the guys that produced the chicken oh. attack. I did not realize that. And uh, so there's like four of these songs where it's just this guy, like it's set up like a martial arts film, but this guy just starts yodeling and throws a chicken at his, at his enemies. And the chicken turns into a human and starts doing karate and a chicken suit. Now that sounds pretty cool. It's if cool. you haven't listened to Chicken Attack, I, you know what? Even pause this. You're on YouTube. <laughs> pause this. Go watch it. Come back. You're not going to regret it. It's I'm changed my life right now. Do it, and then of course right I'll enjoy it. There you go. <laughs> You'll love it. You got it. Nice modern technology. Isn't it beautiful? Hey, can't beat it. So you like the new Hogwarts game? I do. I'm not very far because I'm not very good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I just like fiddle around. I know. Mm -hmm. Like Chris makes fun of me so much because I like fly my broom, but I'm only going like two miles an hour because I'm not good at driving <laughs> the cars on the stuff. Might as well just walk. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I bought it for my wife and daughter, and uh, but my wife hasn't finished God of War, so my daughter's like, you have to finish God of War first. Like oh. it's kind of violent, but okay. <laughs> you guys are bonding. This is cool. Hey, you gotta do what you gotta do when you got kids. Yeah, she's only nine. But no, it's pretty fun. <laughs> I am house Slytherin. I wasn't, but I am. Why would did you got to choose, didn't you? Yes, but at first they were like Gryffindor, and I was like, no. Yeah, wrong. I thought you were I'm weren't right. you able to like import your stuff from Pottermore or did that not end up happening? I don't know. We couldn't figure it out. Like we even like when you first loaded it up, it was like, Hey, if you go on this website and da, 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 whatever you can like, I just want to play your person there. And then it just didn't work. Nope. Oh, there so. she is. <gasps> um, <laughs> but there are different storylines depending on which house. Like there are more stuff. Mm -hmm. There are I, I Chris's Grace, next go round. He's going to be Hufflepuff. I'm pretty sure Jess is a Gryffindor and Grace is a Hufflepuff, and I might go Ravenclaw just to see. There you go. Oh, she's a Ravenclaw. 
So I'll, maybe I'm a Hufflepuff. <laughs> She's yelling at me. Well, I don't know if you heard that. Hufflepuff gets to do some pretty cool things that not everyone else gets to do. They all Which do. is why he's going to be Hufflepuff next go. <laughs> That'd be cool. Very cool. Uh, I can't wait to try it. I just hadn't it's got around to it. I've been playing um, Sons of the Forest, which has been kind of interesting. It's fun. Survival Too horror. spoopy for me. There's uh, cannibals. There's like three different tribes of cannibals. One has teeth all the way down their abdomen, like a big old mouth. <laughs> just eat you. It's just oh, a okay. big mouth. And, and legs. A mouth and legs. <laughs> hey, you know, sometimes you just got to do what you got to do when you're hungry. Uh, amen. I say that's amen. I feel like sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> I now, need to we quit doing been that. Though. A lot lately. We, um, what have we been watching with the mushroom people? Oh, The Last of Us. Oh, yep. I've got this episode three. I keep falling asleep. Uh, I'm just sleeping. We have one. I'm a sleeping We boy. have the episode that aired on Sunday, and we're going to watch that one first because supposedly it's the scariest one, and I'm a big old sissy. And then we're going to watch our ritual on Tuesday, which is <laughs> Thousand Pound Sisters. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. I just uh, I don't watch oh, TV blurry. often, but uh, last night I started watching The Witcher. I uh, see. I tried that and couldn't get into it. I'll try it again though. I got like maybe fifteen minutes into it before my ADHD kicked in. Hey, you need one of them fidget toys. Mm. Yes. <laughs> do you have one? <laughs> no. I've got no. Something. Oh, you do. Look at that. That's cute. That is pretty fun. It's a uh, T Rex. That's a friend cool. of my mine. Three D printed it for me. My mom has a three D printed lizard that sits on their coffee table when they go to shows, and his name is Bean. <laughs> it's a bean. Yep. <laughs> oh, these guys that they're in a band called Tempest, and uh, they have like a a skull as their mascot that they set out on their merch table and they named him Terry for some reason. And I don't know why I don't understand any of it. <laughs> Sorry. Stevie. <laughs> the it man. Mine. No, it's mine. Here, have a treat. Oh, look, my husband say hi. Hi, Mr. Bacon. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Bacon. <laughs> they said, Oh, well, I'll tell him. Later. <laughs> He doesn't know how cool we are yet. <laughs> are we the coolest? Ah! It is warm in my house today, but I'm not it's turning it below 65. It's hot up here, too. Do I have I a fan running in my mic? Because I just realized I've had a fan running in this room this whole time. I, I haven't heard I don't anything. Hear it. Awesome. Because that would have sucked. <laughs> I don't hear it. <laughs> Jesus, we didn't want to say anything. <laughs> Don't believe him. We've had worse recordings. I've been making these little uh, trading card coasters lately, and I got a fan cool. running. Yeah, those are getting better. I even made one just for me. What does it say? Hey, say stay saucy. It says stay saucy, ho bags. Beep. <laughs> we'll start beeping it so it's family friendly. <laughs> I don't know. I'm thinking about phasing that out, but I don't know. Nah, I like it. I'm just gonna. I don't know when I. When, I don't know. It's weird. This show's been going on for a long time. It's four years. Oh. I mean, it's a long time, but that's good. Girls. <laughs> it's been like four and a half years since I started the Confound Millennial. And uh, and I was just doing a lot of drinking back at the beginning of it. That's when I met you. Sometimes <laughs> yeah. that happens. Yeah, I uh, don't drink anymore, but man, there's like, you know, you were... Uh, you were asking earlier, Janie, about like an old throwback episode. Yeah. And I was like, okay, we ignore the drunk seasons. <laughs> Listen, everyone has their see? everyone has their seasons. 
If you want to can... listen to uh, Sturvin belligerently drunk with a horrible microphone and a <laughs> old laptop, that's season one. Oh, uh, we could um find the season where we met. That'd be a good one. No, that's that's not our that's not Confound Millennium. That's still still cast. We just pirate it. Pirate. <laughs> For one of our episodes. <laughs> we just write Jonathan and be like, hey man, we're just stealing your stuff blatantly <laughs> now. We're not even gonna ask you. We're just gonna upload all of your stuff onto our it's channel. It's important. It's for you know. science. I get better to ask for forgiveness than permission. No, you can be fine with it. I don't even ask for either. <laughs> that guy sucks. <laughs> I hate him. <laughs> Just kidding. We just start a support group for those affected by that show. <laughs> we should. AA for still cast viewers. <laughs> oh, it would yeah, just be that Casey it. guy, and then be like, Willie Fred looked at me funny. <laughs> he made me feel uncomfortable. Oh, Mark Weathersby. He owes me a shirt. That's what Mark would say. That's hilarious. He's, but it's my belt anyway. <sighs> We need to let it go, Diamonds. I'm gonna burn the belt live on the show. No, I need to. I need to hold it at least. We we'll burn it together. We will burn it while you're wearing it. <laughs> I mean, maybe like safety first. I knew this guy that he was a complete pyro, right? He used to be my roommate. I go outside one day. He's got like these gloves made of duct tape and license plates. And then on the knuckles, it's like a piece of shirt, like a cloth. And I walk out, and he's soaking it in lighter fluid. Oh my god! <clears throat> and tell, then he tell. had it. He had one of the gloves had a lighter built in, so he just went, <laughs> and uh, his fist lit on fire, and he starts punching. He's like, dude. And it starts getting hot. He's like, ah! And just like stripping them as the uh, like duct tape's melting into the ground. That's I mean, horrible. I can't say I haven't ever lit anything on fire because we definitely went through the period of like the hand sanitizer and you put a whole bunch on and then light it and then you freak out because your hand's on fire. We did that. I never did that. No, I did try out. that. I tried that thing that Ben was talking about that one time. And that was dangerous. <laughs> We'll, we don't want to go there. Watch the old what episodes. What band was that, anyways? It was, was it the Dead Deads? And no, it was D. Monte, tour. but I can't remember yeah. which band she That's said right. did it. Oh, we have to go back and watch it. it I won't it, say it was like Hinder, maybe. Maybe. It's all right. You don't need to know. Things were burnt off. <laughs> <laughs> Not important things. There you go. It was, a, it was a good episode. It it's fun. actually, Janie, just go listen to the trailer for the podcast. That's a clip in that, I think. I'll have to, I'll have to go in and, like, look. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, I don't know. Like, I love talking to these bands that we get to talk to because you just hear the craziest stuff, man. Oh, well, I'm they sure. Get, they give me bad ideas. Well, if Diamond's bad life advice, yeah. <laughs> that needs to be a segment in the show is just like we cut. All right, we're starting it now. Janie, what is your bad life advice for Diamonds? <laughs> what should you try this week I that mean, no one should ever try? I have it's, to report it's, back. <laughs> you know, it's not a bad idea. It's good. I knew it. I knew it. No, my idea isn't a bad idea, but your idea, Janie, needs to be a bad idea for diamonds. Oh. Okay. Oh, um, I see it. Have um, you seen the like, TikTok of the dude who wears like, the shock collar through the drive through like the dog shock collar? Oh, I have. Yep. Yep. Yeah, I mean, we, you can try it. Can what? You do that long distance? Yeah. Um, I don't know. But your wife could, <laughs> we do, a whole your episode. Wife could do the remote. <laughs> She'd love to have. <laughs> Get a little bit of anger out. It'd be funny to do an episode where I could shot Sturvin while we're doing this, and he could do you the same. You could just to pretend. 
<laughs> I like it. I like it. We're we're brainstorming. This is great. Hey. He doesn't want to pretend. He wants to hurt me. <laughs> Slowly. Uh, I mean, no. <laughs> I wasn't doing that. <laughs> Oh, the torment. <laughs> What's over there, man? Oh, um, sorry. I was just checking to see if these uh, coasters. coasters were ready. They're not. Not quite. Sadly. What? Not quite. Oh, okay. I heard something totally different. <laughs> well... That's a shame. That's a shame. Hey. You're a shame. <laughs> Good job. Dang. Dang. He did Dang. it right. I'm so proud of him. I'm learning. Okay, big question, Janie. Yes. Wait, who, am I pointing at diamonds you, right now? So di diamonds is under my hand currently. Uh -huh. Okay, so and you can see it right. Diamonds, for some reason, isn't seeing it right. Yes, and then now am you're I, under this hand. Am I not pointing? Right? No. Yes, now you're pointing the correct way, diamonds. On my screen. For diamonds, it's, yes. it's, he's not. It's serving, and then you. That's weird. Yeah, I need to no. flip it around. I'm at the it's bottom of mine, so that's all it's I got to worry about. Here's the story of Janie Bacon. There she is. <laughs> it's me. Who is straightening so up? So it's now world? Janie's show. I'm the co-host, and so Janie. Welcome right? to my is show. Janie? And that's serving. See, you're wrong. No. Oh wait, go back. Gotta, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like playing musical chairs. I love this. I think you want. Oh man. <laughs> I I I know that this like to you guys this probably seems like a train wreck of an episode okay. but I like this it reminds it. me of the old earlier <laughs> like I like interviewing the bands but I miss like I used it used to just be a hangout show and I miss that sometimes Hey I'm always down for a hangout Hang it all yeah. up No Put it on fire <laughs> no. <laughs> Not again. So I mean, it didn't hurt. <laughs> <clears throat> that okay. Time. That time. This, I didn't this have time any knuckle hair afterwards. And, I, you know what? Here's the deal, Diamonds. Do it again, and I'm going to put it out with my foot. Okay. Is that Stilettos. a promise? <laughs> well. <laughs> All right. Well, that's, that's the, the show. Event. That's the show. Um, <laughs> introducing our new co-host, Janie Bacon. Um, but no, Janie, uh, got anything you want to say about like business-related things or if anybody's looking for a social media manager? Absolutely. Want to shout out your stuff? Yeah, I'm definitely looking to take on a few more clients. Um, I can do a lot of different things. Um, like I said, I have a main job, so I'm scheduling letting, you know, sending out messages to who they need to go to, responding to messages, um, fulfill, helping to fulfill the orders that need to be done, all kinds of things. Um, I would love to be able to just talk to people or give advice. I do that for some people who may be struggling and having a small business. Um, just get, getting some ideas out there to get their business out there and then in turn, you know, helping them thrive is my goal. Um, so feel free to check me out on Facebook, Bacon Social Media Management. Um, I would love to chat and see what we could do. All righty. Awesome. And uh, thank you guys once again <laughs> for coming around and just uh, bull shooting the crap with me today. Hey. Uh, <laughs> this may not have been like the most expected episode Janie but today hey. I just needed to chill with some friends hey. so thank you both chill time's always a good time We're all friends. right well thank you Janie uh You're welcome. maybe we'll have you on again sometime uh maybe near the end of the year sure just to see like you know, we could do like a report of like how crazy awesome the podcast has taken off. Yes, uh, that's our year, goal. That's our goal. That's we'll what we're manifesting. 
It's great. I'm and then sorry. also, like, after we record, we need to talk about, like, doing a monthly meeting. But he, uh, anyways, um, <laughs> this has been the convo. That was me saying don't leave after I start playing the intro or outro music. Uh, this has been the convo. <laughs> This is the 